Northwest Montana has seen a good amount of snowfall in the last couple days, and while some wanted to stay away from the cold and snow, a Montana ski town came alive. MTN's Jack Ginsburg takes us to Big Mountain. Well, it snowed about just under a foot overnight, and it's still lightly coming down here. Schools have been canceled because of road conditions, and winter enthusiasts are getting out in any way they can. I'm going to go head up to the ski mountain to see what all the excitement is about. Skiers and snowboarders got up Big Mountain Road in a hurry today to catch almost a foot of fresh powder at Whitefish Mountain Resort. When ski towns like Whitefish get a large amount of snow like this, the town basically shuts down and the surrounding mountains come alive. I can see that everybody that can take the day off has taken the day off. All the parking lots are pretty jammed right now, so it's a lot of locals are here today. The excitement level is running very high. And not just the locals, but out-of-staters who moved to Montana because of snow days like this were also getting in on the action. Oh, it's awesome. I mean, days like this are kind of what you live for as a skier. I mean, everybody's excited. Everybody, you know, jumped out of bed, uh, ready to get to the mountain this morning. And uh, it's just everybody out here having a good time. Not only were people skiing today, but finding fun in the snow in other ways as well. Devin Harshbarger, a Border Patrol officer, has his own drone photography company he runs on the side. And he says days like this are perfect to go out there and grab some shots. When these big dumps of snow come along, it's great to get out and get some great drone footage. The colder temps make your battery times a little shorter, but there's nothing like seeing that fresh snow, fresh terrain, everything for the first time. With more snow and cold temperatures on the way, outdoor winter enthusiasts will have more than enough time to play. In Whitefish, Jack Ginsburg, MTN News.